queer. Uh, the suggestion is that there is a deliberate delay in reconstituting the IEBC. Uh, why would this be? What does it benefit anyone to delay the IEBC? Is it that probably the issue of the delimitation of boundaries is too thorny an issue that no one would want uh, to uh, probably work on right now? Uh, probably because we're already in defiance of the constitution, that probably in the next three years, it's too short a period to conduct delimitation of boundaries. It is a hot potato, let's leave it till after the next elections. Could that be the reason? <clears throat> Ed Mule, uh, let us uh, just check back uh, 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 and, uh, wha wha and mostly why this particular scenario we are in. Uh, we are in uh, Araika <coughs> or Kwagame. And I would like to say that there was a serious effort to constitute uh, the, the IBC. I remember very well that actually the government already set the panel for that particular uh, process. But at some point, there was a stalemate uh, where the political parties didn't agree and the issue, uh, 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 an, an issue uh, uh, arised. But I believe if we are able to create what we call uh, uh, a broad-based government, and we have agreed, and we have shared slot, I don't think that to agree matters to do, to reconstitute the IBC is a big and other issue. What is going to be, uh, to, to, to be applied here is only the goodwill. And then we see everything moving on. I don't think it is, it's not for anybody's interest to have people uh, of those three um, uh, uh, constituencies not getting their services just because their members are not in position and they cannot be able to fill those positions because the IBC is the only in charge. In the current problem, we are, the, the, the current scenario we are in matters to do with also uh, appointing a deputy president. Yes, the speaker alluded that in fact uh, there was a consultation with the IBC. But as much as the constitution is concerned, the powers of administrators are not there. The in charge of, of issues to do with the decision making is vested in commission. So I don't think that, in fact, anybody would say that, in fact, anything is moving. If today we cannot be able to be on the ground doing registration, then what is this that the, 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 the administration can, be, can, can tell us they can be able to do if they cannot be able to move on with the registration? I think we are in a, in a squagimaya that, in fact, no single constituency in the whole Republic of Kenya is doing what we, call, what we call normal one center registration in every constituency. Nothing is moving. And this is a total quagimaya that we don't, we don't want to, uh, to, to, to be have alive to this situation. And what I would ask is that the head of state goes, the back stops at you. Make sure that in fact everything is moving. If it's a matter of making prior, uh, uh, priority in what we call uh, the business of the house, to, uh, to give that particular bill the, 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 the interest it's, it, 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 it's quiet, let it be. And I don't think, in fact, in fact, it is anybody's interest to say there's not more. Let me, we have a very serious quote in my uh, demory that the issue that my colleague has stated, issue to do with the elimination of boundaries, it's a big issue in terms of, uh, terms of representation. Some constituencies are totally overcrowded. Nobody can solve this problem except the IBC. Could that be the issue? Could that uh, the reluctance to... I don't believe so. I don't believe so because if it's a, it can be seen as an issue, how can it become an issue? Because this problem is not all over. It is within some specific constituencies. And also there was that element of those other constituencies who, of which were uh, marked as not fulfilled. Mm -hmm. And I don't think that, that, that's an issue, that, 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 that is an issue at all, because that's a matter that can be solved once and for all. I don't think even delaying is a solution. Mm -hmm. I think making things work is when you get the proper solution, because make things, uh, 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 face things head on, 
and that way you'll be able to solve them. But once you put them under the carpet, then what is cropping is suspect and delays which is not giving Kenyan solution and which is giving some constituencies a lot of undeserved. Yes. And we think that in fact the time has come that this is totally a big delay where a, a priority should be uh, given to this particular one. Probably, uh, Honorable Akuya should tell us whether they discuss some of these issues in Naivasha. As, uh, uh, of, of course, yes. But I was very shocked to, uh, to realize that, in fact, the total number of bills that uh, we has approved within uh, two good years is only 80 bills, mm -hmm. the, the, uh, com compared to the last parliament. Was there but, uh, but, but I would say that, in fact, the, the issue mostly is that uh, in the last parliament, the issues that the bills that were mainly coming in is uh, bills to uh, do matters to do with uh, uh, the fulfillment of the constitution. I think the, 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 now that we have dealt with ma major of them, then there are no those serious. Was, there, was there any but I can, discussion? I, but I, but I, I, I would say that in fact. If actually the, parliament, the, the house has no such big business, then why do you have the day okay. of such important abuse? The, the constituency that's uh, named Banisa has been without an MP for 20 months now.